Okay, if you guys are trying this at home, don't do what I just did. See this beautiful Felpro oil pan gasket. I was going to pull the oil pan, but every source I could find says you have to lift the motor to do it. And I'm not doing that. But you can see, look at the size of this thing. I mean, you're basically creating this out of RTV, and it's just a huge chunk. So I was going to cut it here and here, and then just put this piece in there. But I just decided with the lip, it was going to be too hard to get it in there that way. So I gave up. And I'm going to go around it one more time so I can review it later. And make sure. It doesn't even need, according to the A1 Audio Auto video, it doesn't need that art that blue RTV I put around it. It doesn't say to even use that, but I'm going to do it anyway. And then we get down here. Don't, you guys don't do this. This is awful. I don't know what else to do. I want my damn truck back. So I basically just used about three quarters of a tube of that gray RTV. And I, that stuff is everywhere. But. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure. If nothing else. I got good coverage with it. It's not pretty. And this part really sucked. Because I can't see behind that. That's a, a blank off where if you had a crankshaft position sensor, that's where it would go and it wouldn't be blanked off like that. But yeah, I can't see behind it. So I had to fill the entire gap with that RTV. But all things considered, and the fact that I'm broke, the creditors are coming after me, and that Harley is killing my backside, this is what I'm going with. So do yourself a favor, on a 95 Chevy with the 4.3, just pay somebody to do it. Replace the oil pan gasket and do it right. I'll be surprised if this thing makes it out of the driveway without leaking. Anyway, I'm going to put the uh, harmonic balancer on next, and we'll see how that goes. Oh, and the RTV says it has to sit hand-tightened for an hour before you torque it down. I already forgot what the torque spec was to, I don't know, 220 inch-pounds or something, but I'll get back to that later. All right, see ya.